All right, last one so far. I haven't checked what else is out there yet. So how do you know when you're pushing yourself well, it, when you're pushing yourself well with weights, but not too hard, and how do you tell? So you know you're pushing yourself. For me, I know I'm pushing myself when I see two things, my body changing, and then also, if you're lifting weights, you should be able to lift more weights the next week. They say to write your progress down, write down what you're doing. So let's say you lifted 10 pounds doing curls for 12 reps in one workout. The next week, you wanna increase either the weight or the reps for that same workout. If you're not increasing it, then you're not pushing yourself. It's, it, it's supposed to be hard. So you're not supposed to necessarily get through every workout. Eventually, somewhere down the road, you're gonna put more weight on not physically, well maybe you will be, because if you put on muscle, you will be putting more weight on, but you're gonna be putting more weight on the barbell or the dumbbell, whatever it is that you're using, and it's gonna get harder for you. If you're not making it harder for you, you're not, your body's gonna adjust. Your body has the ability to adapt like crazy. I mean, if you really push it, it's gonna adapt super, super fast. So if you're not doing that, then you won't see results. So you have to keep, it's called um, uh, the words. I can for some reason has the ability to just steal words away from you. You want to do a progressive overload, basically, is what it's called. So continually challenging the muscles and making them adapt to a new stimulus. Uh, so that's how you know that you are pushing yourself. Don't do the same thing. If you do the same thing every single time, you will not change. I think Einstein's the one who said that. You can't expect to do the same thing over and over and over and expect change. It's just not gonna work. You have to do a little bit more, whether it's one more rep the next time or one more pound the next time. You have to do one of the two, otherwise you're not adapting, you're not changing, uh, you're staying exactly the same. That's a great way to tell if you're improving. Uh, how should you break up your weekly workouts? Me.